Hey, what's up? It's Vic, founder of Blue Jay Entertainment. I'm here to show you how to join BMI as a songwriter and how to register your song. This is the first of many tutorial videos that I'll have coming to this channel. So if you find it helpful, do me a favor, click subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified anytime I have new tutorials, more music business content. Why in the first place would you join as a songwriter in BMI? Because you want to collect your performance royalties. And there's different types of royalties that you can get from a song and performance royalty is one. As basically if you ever get your song in movies, TV shows, video games, if you or if you even perform live and you want to submit your set list to BMI, you'll get paid for that. As long as the venue is paying for a blanket license, then you'll get some revenue from that. I'm going to show y'all step by step what you need to do to sign up as a songwriter on BMI. So the first thing you need to do, you need to go to hover over creators. Then you need to go where it says join BMI. Click that, click join BMI. Now you have two options. You can either join as a songwriter or you can join as a publisher. If you join as a songwriter, it's completely free. Uh, you don't need to make any payments. If you're with ASCAP, you'll have to pay $50. So just keep that in mind when you're trying to choose the PRO that you want to go with. Uh, to join as a publisher, it's $250. So look at it like this. Your performance royalties is like a pie of 200%. 100% would be your songwriter share, and then the other 100% would be the publishing share. All right, and then next step is you'll click join as a songwriter. Then it's going to ask you for your, your personal information. You're going to, you know, fill this out. You're going to click next. They're going to ask you for your social security number. So if you're registering as a songwriter, you put your social security number. If you're registering as a publisher, that's when you can use your EIN. EIN is short for employee identification number. You get that through the IRS. But for the sake of this video, I'm just going to show you how to do it as a songwriter. Once you fill your social security number out, your date of birth, if you have any AKAs, if you're going to any under any other names, you fill that out right here. You're going to click next. After that, it's going to ask you if you have any previous affiliations with other PROs because it's it's important to note that you can only be with one PRO at a time. You can't sign multiple agreements with different PROs. If you're with BMI, you'd be with them. If you're with ASCAP, then you'll be with them. The term agreement for a songwriter is two years with BMI. It automatically renews if you don't uh, switch to put no here. Then it's going to ask you a review. It's going to be a review of everything that you inputted. Make sure that's correct. Okay, because uh, if it's not, you're going to have to contact BMI and that's just going to be a whole other headache that you want to avoid. So you click next. They're going to give you the agreements. You're going to review each document and then you're going to click, I have reviewed the terms and conditions. Once you're done with that, you will hit submit. But for the purpose of this video, I'm not going to submit it. This is just to give you an example on how to do it. Now, once you hit submit, your application will be then completed. You'll need to wait um, five to seven days or so for it to be processed. And then they'll give you, they'll send you an email with uh, what's called your IPI number. That's basically your barcode. So if you ever do any music with anybody else, they'd be able to identify you using that IPI number. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to register a song on BMI where it says, works registration click on that right here where it says in process works you'll click on your name you're gonna click here add new work all right and then select the type of work you are registering it'll be classic or all other genres it depends what you're submitting here what kind of song it is so if it's all other genres, rock, hip hop, pop, you'll just click other genres unless it's classical. You'll click next. And you're gonna type in the title of the work, right? So 
it'll be the song will be trust for the sake of this video that's what we're gonna call it we're gonna put the duration of the song how long the song is we'll say 2 minutes and 25 seconds the language and then is it music only or music and lyrics so if it's a complete song it's gonna be music and lyrics if it's just a instrumental that you have that's in like a video game or something like that then it'll just be music but for now we're gonna we're gonna put that alternative titles also if you have another name for the for the song you can add that on there if your work is a public domain arrangement like or a lyric a foreign lyric version translation then you'll say yes or no most most works are not it even tells you here also which is good because it can be confusing for some does this work contain samples or other melodies if you have taken someone else's melody or other work and you've created it into your own you would put it here but we're not so today we're gonna put that right put under here you're gonna pick a, a publisher if you have a publisher this is where you would put your publisher me I'm Blue Jay Global Publishing, so I'm going to use my publishing company. Um, and then your IPI number. Remember I was telling you about your IPI number? This is where you were going to you put your IPI number. Then you're going to put for the collection. We're going to collect 100% of the publishing. BMI, 100%. Right here under writer, you're going to add yourself as a writer and any other producers, other writers that contributed to the work that you would like to for them to get percentage, this is where you would fill that out. Okay, you would put their IPI number right here. The role is, are you the author, the composer, are you both? You put that there, you put the writer's share here. Uh, this is where you put the 100% for your writer's share, so you can collect it unless you are splitting it with somebody else, you do it here. All right, and then let's just say, let's say 100 for right now. And it, it says right here, percentages, total rider share cannot exceed 200%. So keep that in mind. All right, so this is how you do it. You have to go, if you have a publishing company like me, you wanna collect your publishing royalties, you put 100% ownership here, you put 100% collection, and then you'll put 100% collection on the writer share. And it shows the publishing link here, and the songwriter right here, you'll add more songwriters. You need to make sure it equals 200%. So this is 100, this is 100, right? Now that this is set up, you click next. Now that you're going to add, are there any artists on this song? You're going to say yes. Are there any recordings? Yes, if you created a song. Is this work created for film, theater? You'll say no unless you specifically made it for a movie. It doesn't mean you can't get it in one of those. Just saying. And then uh, you would add the artist's name here. So my artist's name, Blue Jay. First name, Victor. You would click next. This is going to be a single. The recording title of the song. What was it? Trust. And then you'll put the release date. Just click for today. Was this recording released by a record label? Yes or no? Say yes. What record label? Put my, uh, my business. Once you've hit submit, you have you're completed. You've already you know learned how to join BMI as a songwriter and how to register your song. It'll take a couple of days for BMI to you know approve or deny it. They'll let you know through email. And as always, thank y'all so much for the support. If you have any other questions or anywhere else that I can help you out, please leave a comment below. If you want more of a one-on-one, -on -one, I do consultations for a fee. You can 
contact me through bluejayentertainment.com. That's blue J, blue without the E. It's a common mistake. Or you can email me directly, bluejaybookings at gmail.com. Uh, yeah, and as always, thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, hit the notification bell. Later. Hook em. Bitch, I'm major. My unit tailored. Break down a swish. I'm smoking flavors. My pocket swole up. Can't do no favors. I got my weight up. Dead AC Slater.